I'm John Skinner, and this supports my book, Fishing for Summer Flounder, and you can learn more about the book at flounderbook.com. I'll be jigging with SNS John Skinner Swing Hook Fluke Bucktails and Tsunami Silicone Skirt Glass Minnow Teasers, and I'll have links to all of the gear in the description of the video, and I'll also have a link to a video that will show you how to tie that rig. All right, this turned out to be my last fluke trip of the 2018 season. I'm out on uh, Rick's beautiful 32-foot metal shark, fishing with John Halkius and John Sweeney and uh, Cliff in the back. So we've got a boatload. And uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, look at that fancy. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah. yeah wow, oh, that's the, the one. Oh, that looks like it's custom. This is extra long. <laughs> Only four in existence. Wow. Got the hair, cut the hair over the factory. They screwed up. So yeah, those are tsunami glass minnows, but uh, I think the factory made a mistake and they made them with really extra long tinsel. Uh, actually, the, they worked out pretty well. I saw that. <laughs> Nice, got a good size fish. Good. Seven or eight. Yeah. Nice. Seven or eight. Good. You think ten? Yeah. Nice. Nice fish, man. Good job. Oh, nice one. Oh yeah, that's good. Oh beauty. Yeah, John. On the Parker, on the Parker teaser again. I love these teasers, man. Well, I don't think. Uh, I'm gonna mark that one. We're kind of we're, we're kind of at the end of our our marks here, but let's uh, let's stay here for a little bit, huh? I'm gonna turn this all right, this whole trip, the drift is messed up. It's just really taking the boat on a funny angle. What Rick's trying to do here is just just kick it to the side to get the lines straight out, but uh, I'm not in a good position for him to do that. Um, but yeah, we're gonna deal with uh, nasty currents, funny drifts. Uh, the whole trip, yeah. I don't know what was up, but lobster pot buoys that we saw, they were like almost being sucked under, and sometimes we have to use six ounces. Um, but uh, yeah, we're gonna do okay. He's not very fat, not wide. Very fat. He's not wide. Beauty, though, beauty. Did you throw it back yet? No. Skinner, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, don't get this out of your way. It's all right, it's not in my way. I got the net, Rick. Is it a keeper? No, he's coming up really fast. I think he's gone. Oh. I think he might be a really fast. That's a fluke. You mean, you mean a net? Fluke? Yeah, I'm trying to not, I'm not yeah. snag him. Are you uh, with me there, John? I got a bad deal, buddy. Hey, look at Rick. I love how you do this. You don't put me in the glare. Ah, Rick's on see, something big. Right. Oh, yeah, look at that. Quick. Huh. Nice job, buddy. All right. I'm getting out of here. Let me, let me go to the He's back. He's going to me. You come switch Keep going. All right. I'm it's trying to a... minimize this mess here. Yeah. So that, let me just get by you not... guys real quick. Just yeah. So I can help yeah. Take care of him. Big fish. All right. So and this is easy. Way. Yeah. I think you just took what's up there. Okay. Try to put your Got it. Job, yeah. Like uh, somebody else. <laughs> All right. I need the net here. No, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> Next, you're going to tell us that's a 10 pounder. <laughs> No, that's a big fish. He's coming straight up, but you saw that head shake? That's, that's a big fish head shake. Mark the spot, Rick. Mark the spot. Spot mark it right now. I know, it's okay. The more we have, the better. Nice fish, nice fish. Yeah. Big fish, man. Suck off, suck off. Good job. Nice fish, man. Another seven and a half. Man. Well, I guess he's got to get lucky someday. What is this with the blue reel here, John? <laughs> Captain the blue, blue reel is white nice and fish. black on this job. Boat. White. That's old technology. White. <laughs> white. Oh. You gotta go back to the store. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm going back shopping this week. Holy moly, a blue reel. Are we still with the, the quantum? Yeah, it's it's quantum, yeah. That'll be available next year. Look at that. 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 Look at
guys like you. Like that looks like no, a the fancy other side looks handle really too. Good. Ah, it's J&H handle. All right, so you heard uh, Rick commenting on the reel. Yes, that's a Quantum Accurist S3. The S3 just came out the end of 2018. Uh, has more ball bearings, definitely a smoother reel. And that blue color, uh, that's only available at J&H Tackle. They, they have an exclusive on that blue. Um, and the power handle on there is also from J&H. And it's, and it's a really reasonably priced one, 20 bucks for that power handle. So uh, there's links to all of that in the description of the video. Yeah. Well, I've never seen that before. Oh, that's, that's really pulling. There you go. Whoa. John's in a nice one. Oh. It's still on our first drift. He just took my fish. I'll need a net. I got it. I got it. Uh, posting on Instagram, Skinner. You just, uh... Oh boy, I think we're hooked up. Yeah, yeah, you are. Uh, you're, you're not bad. Let's wow. just get the fish. It's okay. Nice fish. All right, let's not... All right, this is easy. Yeah. In fact, just hold them. Just... Yeah, I am, I am. We're good. We got the dock, in the docket. Wow. Very, nice fish. Very nice, Skinner. On the what? what is? What did he hit, Skinner? That looks different. That, no, no, he hit the. That's oh, that's the new tsunami teaser. The new. Uh, you okay? Yeah. I grabbed. Unfortunately, I had the braid in my oh. hand. I meant to grab the leader and missed it. That's a fatty, no? Yeah. yeah. Not like a halkie. What did it weigh? Did you weigh him? No, I didn't weigh him. I already chopped him. And that was eight pounds inside that fish. That's what I thought. I thought I heard you say ten. I'm not being a dick. I, I didn't just... say ten. Sweeney said. Oh. I heard ten. I, I heard nine. I, I, that's... I, I said. I told Skinner. I said that's seven or eight. And I turned around. and goes. I think it's ten. That's what I. I that's say why I, I came swear back to God, here. I did not say ten. I have it on the video. I... So let's fact check halkies here. Uh, yeah, I have it on video too. He said ten. So it's fish. Good. Seven or eight. Yeah. Nice. Seven or Good. Eight? You think ten? Yeah. Nice. Nice fish, man. Good job. Oh, I got a big fluke. Oh, big fluke. Big fluke. Big fluke. He gets so excited. He needs to net that. I really am, Bob. Put that too fast in the box. I'm up too, you know. Just so you know, I'm up. It doesn't matter. Well, it does because he's not in the way. His line isn't there, so it's worth knowing. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be maybe tangled. I was, I was coming up here to find the net, and it was not here. Is that that new reel, John? No. Oh yeah, all, all the fish are on the blue reel now. <laughs> Heads up. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's impossible. I can't, I can't not yell at Hathius when he nets the fish because he's like, I don't know where he's looking. I was day. Oh, he was. You were doing what? You were daydreaming. Was yeah. <laughs> See? I really was. This is this is uh, no matter how hard I try. John, John he was looking for the glare. <laughs> I, 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 was, I think he was. <laughs> hey, that's. I think it must be that teaser that John. And Doc's out here too. He's out here on uh, his boat, so we're gonna get to see him for a second. Yeah. Doc's got a netter. <laughs> Doc wants to not be. Oh, okay, he's acting like the big, yeah, it's big, big fish acting there. I think he got a good one. Nice fish, Doc. That's a beauty. Can you yell that louder? So. Okay. And? Orange gulp, right? <laughs> oh, 
you, you know, Doc, I had five packs in total, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. And uh, an eight, eight pound on that trip. Nice. nice. Louie? That was just... Louie, right? Huh? Louie? No. Oh, Andy? Two, no, two keepers just now on that trip. We have, yeah. I think they're starting to fight again. That would be nice. No, Rick, we already got a donut. You're looking at I, it. I've switched to apple pies. Uh, you you copying me now? Uh, no, actually, uh, Michael Kim brought them, and instead of eating donuts, I had that, and I got a 12-pounder. So now it's only apple pies. It was hard to tell from the hook set, though. <laughs> well, he's he set the hook with the engines. He he power sets. What do you got this mean? Okay, all right. All right. I'm coming. John, just watch my rod that it doesn't like break off in the holder. Yeah, that really sweetie. Maybe get it. Yours? Oh, you're up Mine is not a swinger. Big from here, no? Yeah, it does. I'm no, not. it's spinning. It's spinning. It's foul. Right? I think so. Uh, I'm just trying to get out Got him from underneath. Oh, okay. So, John, after you bring that up, if you could just deal with my rod so it doesn't get... Hung. I got two doormats to deal with here. Two doormats. Yeah, actually, bring the other nets. This is the biggest doormat. No, it's not going to be bigger than this. Not even close. Good job. Good job, Skinner. Good job. Slack, slack, slack. Okay, we're down to. You're okay. Just yeah. Give it a lot of slack because you're caught. Don't pull. Don't pull. You're caught on my. We don't need the other net. We don't need the other you net. You caught a Greek too. All right, your net. You're free. Your rig is free. Which one? The one on the floor right there. It's good. You, you caught that? Oh yeah. Come on. This is bigger though. This is this is a beauty. Oh wow. Okay, okay, John. Up, 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 up. Nice. Dump, maybe a double. Is it? No. No? I don't think so. Maybe. It's up there though. Woo. Oh, it's gonna be I'm close. The Skinner Bucktail. Thank oh. you, Skinner. Very good. I gotta get back in the water. Look at look at look at your fish next to mine. Let me see. All right, that fish was a little bit over nine pounds, and that was a personal best for Halkia, so congrats to him. Uh, listen to what uh, Sweeney says here about this hook set. It's going to be important. It was... That's, uh, that's oh, there you go. Oh, there's a oh, shit. Bad hook set. And it's a heavy... Thank God, that rigging system even over there. It's not a good yeah, hook fish, set. Right, Sweeney? It's a good fish, yeah. All right, quick. I'll get the net. I'll get the net. I got it's uh, yeah. not going to be yours, though, Johnny. That I can tell you. This is uh, this is about four pounds. The way the current's going, I'll only tell you two. I don't know which rod is that. The heavy one. Well, oh, that's a big fish then. Yeah, yeah but the current's been whipping. Yeah, no, no, no. Get, get some weight there. Yeah. I didn't get to set the hook. Well, actually. you know why you hooked this fish, right? Yeah, I do. It's the apple I'm pie. Have another apple pie. <laughs> <in a minute. laughs> oh, that's a. Big one. I mean, when you know. When you need a big one, go to the apple pie. No, go to Skinner. <laughs> Ask for advice. <laughs> what, what the camera doesn't have is all the advice I was just asking on the uh, reset, right? Swim a little bit. Here he is now. Oh! Get it? No. Shit. Wow, way, so close. Way, way down. Yeah, so what do we tell Doc? That's uh, 10 pounds? Yeah, 12 pounds. <laughs> So a good hook set is just so important with this fishing. You know, we're in 85 feet of water. We're dealing with current. And uh, John knew it right off. He said three times it was a bad hook set. And <clears throat> you saw what happened. The fish got up close to the surface, just took a shake, and uh, off it went. So, yeah, it uh, happens sometimes. Yeah, he's got a good. That felt like bottom. Yeah. You 
driving up on them. I like that. I like that. This is a good fish. Apple pie. This is a good fish. Yep. Yeah. Okay, go. I, I almost have to pump it. Okay, no drama netting. Ink. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. You can tell by those those kicks right there. Yeah, yeah right there. I like and, that. And he kicks off. He come yeah. totally slack. I mean, you know, I'm not letting it. But really trying to slack. All right, Skinner S and S Bucktail, hang on. It's got it. Oh, you can see that guy five miles down. He's so big. Right. Oh wow, nice, John. Hey. Slack. Yeah, heavy, yeah, heavy good, fish. You're good, you're good. Thick. Yeah, heavy fish. The boca? Yeah. <laughs> what did what'd you catch him on, John? Uh, oh, look at that. Skinner, John Skinner SNS Bucktail. Ow. Just whipped that bucktail right next to my uh, Well, you, that's. Through the boot and it hurt. I'm sorry, there's no liability with that. Thank you. Yep. Now he's coming up all of a sudden. Thanks. What is it? All right, let's cook these up. Fillets into the egg and then into some flour. Just get a nice coating on there. Uh, while this is happening, I've got uh, a pan of oil that's uh, heating up to 375 degrees. And uh, yeah, we're going to make some uh, pineapple glazed fluke. All right, here we go, into the oil. Um, I'm using olive oil. Uh, you use the oil of your choice. I've heard peanut oil is also good. And uh, yeah, I did cook a few minutes. I flipped them in between, get that nice golden brown look, put them onto some paper towels to uh, drain off the oil. And uh, then all we need to do is coat with the glaze. Now this glaze is, uh, is really excellent. This is Robert Rothschild, uh, roasted pineapple and habanero sauce. Thanks to Leon Adler for turning me on to this recipe. Real simple, pour it in there, spread it around um, on the fish fillets, and boy, the finished product just comes out so delicious. Um, and there's a picture of the label, so you can see what that is exactly, and yeah, just a, a great recipe. Hey, look how easy cleanup can be. This particular fry pan disconnects from the base and goes into the dishwasher, so this is great. And there's links to all of that stuff in the description of the video as well. Okay, if you like these videos, please subscribe to my channel.